my name is Mahboob Khan and I'm international uh, tennis teaching professional. I uh, was the first Pakistani uh, who was certified by PTR, Professional Tennis Registry. And later on, I, was, uh, I also did the ITF uh, certification. It's first of all the mindset. The mindset of a nation has to change. Pakistan is a very talented uh, country. Uh, and the Federation obviously needs to become more active and the affiliated units. And uh, as a society, I would say that uh, there has to be uh, emphasis away from cricket. Uh, we have to uh, introduce tennis to the people. Uh, uh, tennis to the people, the recreational base has to be increased. And of course you have to take tennis to the schools and colleges until and unless there's school in, uh, there's a tennis in schools and colleges. We cannot have the revolution which we are, uh, uh, you know, seeking. And for that I think the government of Pakistan has to uh, inject tennis and other sports in the school curriculum. Uh, anything short of that is a miracle. Uh, you are seeking miracle and miracles uh, don't happen nowadays as you know. If we can follow uh, follow the uh, same uh, route as other international developed countries are following, inshallah we, we will also have a Grand Slam champion because I said there is no shortage of ten, uh, talent. We do have talent, just that we need to train this talent and we need to uh, uh, take maximum uh, benefit out of it. Uh, some problems, you know, uh, remember the coaches are the one who produce uh, players and in this, in this country some of the best coaches, they are working in the private sector and I think uh, these coaches, uh, particularly those who have produced players, those who have produced champions, national champions, uh, they should be supported, they should be supported uh, and they should be asked to sort of help uh, in, in national programs. And, uh, uh, and, and of course the economy of the players, there are many talented players uh, but they belong to the poor family uh, until and unless we find uh, proper support for them. From psychological point of view, from mental point of view, uh, the coaches can play a great role. I mean a, a, a loser, a player who is losing the match can can be turned into a, into a winning player. Uh, to that fact, uh, coach ka bahut bada role hai ke player ko psychologically uh, thanda rakhe before the match, during the match, and after the match. Uh, uh, not only the the coach has to help in the technique development or tactical development or physical development. I think uh, the most important uh, thing, uh, as Jimmy Connor said that uh, winning is all in the state of mind. Uh, so uh, the coach has a, has a great role, major role, in working on the minds of, uh, of uh, his players, whether they are girls or boys. And I can tell you that working with the, our national champion, Sara Mahboob Khan, and of course other players, uh, I, can, I, can, I can really tell you that uh, the, the mental side uh, can make or break uh, the player and to that effect I think the coach has a major role to play. Well, uh, apart from tennis, uh, you know, we have been like day and night. I've been working almost seven days a week. Uh, so a, a good coach who is active uh, in tennis uh, has almost no social life. And uh, so I have a very limited uh, social life. Uh, so I think uh, if I were not a tennis coach, I would have been a tennis coach. <laughs> Earlier you mentioned uh, your friends and colleagues and who are not uh, with you anymore. So how has it been uh, coping with the, with the loss of your friends and loved ones? Yes, uh, losing a loved one, like uh, I lost my wife five years ago, Shala, the mother of Sarah. 
And a few days back, in fact, I lost my son. Uh, he was cricket playing son, a fast bowler, uh, a very, very good cricket player. But then he went into a depression when he was not selected. Uh, so he went into a depression and finally he uh, passed away uh, August 25. So obviously uh, these things uh, leave uh, a hole uh, in your heart and these holes are difficult to bridge uh, so you, you, there's no way there's no magic uh, formula there's no magic wounds uh, or mag magic medicine or something which can heal these things so basically you live with these uh, things and the only thing is that you can i can do is that i play tennis i coach tennis i talk to people like you i go to club and uh, you know sometimes i do sing as well uh, so, uh, try to uh, divert my attention from these uh, pressing uh, issues. Uh, try to help others as much as possible. It could be in tennis, or it could be, it could be in uh, uh, maybe just like uh, arranging food for someone, for example, or maybe arranging clothes for someone, or maybe arranging uh, books for someone, or maybe fees for someone. So, try to do as much you can. Uh, to help the poor uh, because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will always reward, always, always reward your effort. I'm very glad that uh, you conducted this interview very, very professionally. Uh, thank you very much.